The House of Representatives on Tuesday received a request for consideration and approval of federal government's 2022 to 2024 external borrowing of the sum of $8.699 billion and 100 million euros through a letter from President Bola Tinimbu. Also received by the House is a letter from President Tinimbu requesting that an audience be granted to him to present the 27 trillion naira budget for the 2024 financial year before a joint session of the National Assembly on Wednesday. The said sums, according to the borrowing plan, as to ensure prompt implementation of projects read and outlined at plenary by the Speaker, Tajuddin Abbas, which cuts across all sectors. The African Development Bank and the World Bank Group have indicated interest in assisting the country to mitigate the impact with a sum of $1 billion and $1.5 billion respectively, in addition to the Federal Executive Council approved 2022 to 2024 external abridged borrowing. I would like to underscore the fact that the projects and programs in the borrowing plan were selected based on positive technical economic evaluation as well as the expected contribution to the socio-economic development of the country, including employment generation, skills acquisition, support towards the emergence of more entrepreneurs, poverty reduction, and food security to improve the livelihood in all 36 states and the federal capital territory. Meanwhile, the House has also urged President Tinubu to sign the sexual harassment of students in tertiary education institutions prohibition bill. The resolution followed the adoption of a motion of urgent national importance at plenary raised by Honorable Kafilat Ogbara, member representing Kosofe Federal Constituency, Lagos State. The House notes that violence against women and girls is a widespread human rights violation affecting one in three women worldwide and causing immediate and long-term harm to their physical, emotional and psychological well-being. Violence including physical, sexual, emotional and female gen genital mutilation related acts has led to se severe physical injuries, trauma and even death. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.